Welcome to the Shias Your Map. Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss the discriminant of a quadratic function. For the quadratic function f of x is equal to ax square plus bx plus c, the expression b square minus 4ac is called the discriminant. So here this b and we have to square that. So b square minus 4 into a into c. So b square minus 4ac is called the discriminant of the quadratic function. So based on this discriminant, we can decide the nature of the roots. So what is the first? The value of discriminant shows how many roots f of x has. If b square minus 4ac is greater than 0, then it has two distinct real roots, which means that it has two different roots. If b square minus 4ac is equal to 0, then it has equal roots. Suppose if you have, uh, if the root is 2, then both the roots will be 2. That is one repeated root. The next one, if b square minus 4ac less than 0, then f of x has no real roots. Both the roots are imaginary. Let us do some problems based on this. Then you will understand more clearly. Calculate the value of the discriminant for these functions. And we are going to discuss the nature of the roots also. Okay. So here we have three functions f of x, g of x and h of x. Now I have taken the first one f of x is equal to x square minus 8x plus 16. So we know that the quadratic equation is of the form ax square plus bx plus c. So here a is equal to 1 because the coefficient of x square is 1. Okay, so a is equal to 1 and b is equal to minus 8 and c is equal to 16. So the discriminant is we know that b square minus 4ac. So what is b square? Minus 8 the whole square minus 4 into a is 1 into c is 16. Now let us calculate minus 8 into minus 8. Minus 8 square is 64. Minus 4 into 16 is again 64. So 0. So here the discriminant is equal to 0. So what is the nature of the root? The two roots will be equal. Or how can we say there will be one repeated root. So how can we say about the nature of the roots? It has two equal roots because the discriminant is equal to 0. So we can say that it has two equal roots or else how can you say it has one repeated root. So for example the root is 2 then we can say that both the roots are 2. Suppose if the root is 3 then we can say that both the roots are 3. Now let's do the second problem. g of x is equal to 2x square minus 3x plus 4. So this is the second problem. g of x is equal to 2x square minus 3x plus 4. Now we are going to find the discriminant of this. So here a is equal to 2, b is equal to minus 3 and c is equal to 4. Now the discriminant b square minus 4ac is equal to minus 3 the whole square minus 4 into 2 into 4. 9 minus 32 that is equal to minus 23 less than 0. So b square minus 4ac is less than 0. b square minus 4ac less than 0. So here now we have found the value of the discriminant. Now let us decide the nature of the roots. So according to the third condition b square minus let me repeat according to the third condition b square minus 4ac less than 0 then we can say that the nature of the roots that is it has no real roots. So the nature of the roots we can say that it has no real roots. Now let us do the next problem. So the third problem is h of x is equal to minus x square plus 7x minus 3. a is equal to minus 1 because the coefficient of x square is minus 1 and b is equal to 7 c is equal to minus 3. Now let us find the discriminant. So b square minus 4ac is equal to 7 square minus 4 into minus 1 minus 3. a is minus 1 and c is minus 3. Now 7 square is 49. 49 minus 12 is 37. B square minus 4ac is equal to 37 is greater than 0. That is our discriminant 
value is 37 and that is greater than 0. Now let us find the nature of the roots. Sorry, let us discuss the nature of the roots. So according to the first condition, the nature of the roots is if it is, if the discriminant is greater than 0, this is the discriminant and if it is greater than 0, then we can say that it has two distinct real roots. Otherwise, otherwise we can say that it has two different real roots. So the nature of the roots is two distinct real roots. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Like and comment. Please to subscribe to our channel.